Greetings. I'm Pastor Eric Smith, and this is Awakening Grace. Sharing with us today is Karen Radcliffe Smith. God's grace can come to us in unexpected ways. During this time of quarantine, reflection has become a daily practice. Well, here's something that I happened on to. In the spring of my junior year of high school, I was invited to audition for a professional production of a rock opera called Tetelestai, Greek for It Is Finished. It had been a difficult year due to the loss of several family members and my mother's frequent absence during that time. The show was a welcome distraction. I was cast as the Apostle Matthew, and throughout the weeks of rehearsal, my focus was on learning my blocking lines and songs. I don't know at what point I began to experience the joy with which most of the other cast members were consumed, nor do I know what compelled me to begin asking the director questions that had more to do with faith than with acting. And no one was more surprised than I when, during the crucifixion scene of our final dress rehearsal, I began sobbing uncontrollably in the back of the theater. It was the tradition at the close of each performance for the actors to move off the stage into the audience singing the exit song. On closing night at the Cleveland Auditorium with an audience of 3,000, the curtain call came, the music swelled, and instead of moving down into the audience, most of the cast encircled me and told me how happy they were for me. You know, at first, I didn't understand what they meant. And then the director pointed out that it was written all over my face. The presence of God in my life, joy, love, such love. I knew he was right. <laughs> I could feel it. My heart was bursting. This unexpected experience of God's grace was healing for me during a very sad time, and it helped me face death with more understanding. Can you recall a time in your life when God's grace came unexpectedly? Did you recognize it for what it was and give God thanks and praise? Will you pray with me? Oh God, you are always with us, even when we don't realize it. Give us ears to hear, eyes to see, and hearts to receive your grace, unexpected or otherwise, in our lives. Amen. <laughs>